city doesn't track with either of those. And so that term means different things to different people depending on the context of the discussion. Uh, we know many, what mean. many of the elements, liar. many of the elements, liar, liar, liar. liar. We, liar. We are here to listen. Liar. You're a liar. We are here to listen. Liar. You're, You're a time for liar. Questions. You are guilty and got blood on your head for this murder, sir. Many of the aspects that are ascribed to sanctuary cities. We know what sanctuary are things mean. that are disallowed by Georgia law. Sanctuary policy, which is what right, we do. And we contribute a document every year to the Georgia Department of Audits indicating that we do not correspond to these definitions under state law. Yes, you do. And no policies have been adopted Please by the mayor and commission You're that have created sanctuary city status in Sir, Athens. You need to resign. One protocol resign. that sometimes arises. Resign, resign now. Resign. You allow one protocol, this to happen, sir. One protocol that sometimes arises is the approach that sheriff's offices. The current situation in Denver highlights a concerning misallocation of government funds. While prioritizing financial aid for migrants, essential city workers such as lifeguards, coaches, and office staff have seen their working hours reduced. This shift in focus towards fiscal matters risks undermining the livelihoods of these individuals and threatens the significance of their work. Despite official denials of layoffs, the reality of reduced hours raises doubts about the government's communication tactics and transparency. This lack of clarity deepens mistrust and fails to address the genuine concerns of those affected. As a result, there are growing worries about the impact of immigration policies on local communities, with perceptions arising that resources are being redirected away from essential services and employment opportunities for citizens.